Hey there, Chad Barnes here for Ohio University Libraries. Today I got an email from a student looking for information about the, the automobile market and the car audio market in India. So this video is going to show you how to use a database called Passport to find information on those topics uh, using a variety of different statistics and market research reports from Passport. So here you go. So when you first arrive at Passport, what we're going to do is uh, you can go up here and search for automobiles in India and that sort of thing, but I would rather browse because you can find more information a little bit quicker in this database if you just browse for information. So we're going to look under Industries here and you'll see there's an Automotive section. So we'll click on Automotive here. And this will take us to uh, a, a home page here for automotive information. We can, we can do different kinds of searches in here. Uh, one way to get started, you might go here to the Dashboard and then just select uh, Automotive and then click go and this is going to default usually to the US um, but what you can do is once it loads is change it to your particular country um, so what we'll do is once it loads here we can go down and change geography and let's go in and we're looking at India so let's go Asia Pacific here and then click India and then do go and so this gives you actual commercial vehicles in use. Now, if you're going to look to expanding into the car audio market, you might want to look at the growth rate, right, to, to figure out um, what um, you know what how India is growing compared to other countries. So let's just look at historic growth, and this will give us a nice map here and kind of shows us uh, that actually India it looks like it's growing faster than the U.S. on and that's commercial vehicles in use. Excuse me. If we want to change the category here to actually passenger cars in use then do go there. Now we're looking at passenger cars in use. Uh, looks like U.S. Is, the growth rate is going down from 2008 to 2013, whereas in India it's growing significantly there. So a great way to kind of get a comparison to figure out what markets you might want to look at um, in looking at um, uh, the car audio market or, or other markets that deal with automobile accessories and things like that. Now if you'd like to dig a little bit deeper in this data, what you can do is go back to Industries and go back to Automotive to, to go back to the Automotive homepage here. And then what we can do is go to the search tree and just choose one of these categories here. I'm just going to choose our, um, um, let's see, our registration, new registration of, uh, of passenger cars. We'll do that and click go. And this will take us uh, to the search tree where then we can, you can see it's selected for us. We can then go in and say let's let's look for automotive circulation, and then here is passenger cars in use, motorcycles, mopeds in use. And then we have things like transport, which will give us distance traveled by modes of transport, for example. And then here we have, you know, average annual distance traveled in car, and then kilometers traveled by road. And so you can see as we do that, we get more uh, information over here on the right hand side. Now what you might also want to do is go up here and just search for automobiles. Um, you can search for automobiles or automotive production or automotive circulation and if we just search for auto here and do filter tree uh, this will bring up all the uh, various categories that have to do with automobiles and so you can basically find uh, additional information in here so here's automotive production circulation there's there's quite a few things that we've already already got there so if we um, you know select what we want we can do that we can also go in and do uh, if you want to search for car, uh, you can do that as well, um, things like that. So we're going to go and click now choose geographies here. And the advantage of doing this over the dashboards area there is we can go into Asia Pacific and then we can select uh, India. And if we want to compare it to other countries, uh, we can do that. And I'm just going to uh, choose a few here. And then um, let's do uh, China, for example. And then we click run search here. This is going to give us um, some reports here in the middle, but we can also go over here and just click on statistics. And the statistics will give us information on uh, the various categories that we looked at there. Uh, this data is downloaded to, to Excel. Uh, in many cases, you can actually go over here and change the time series and change it by year. And instead of looking at actuals, you can actually forecast out. And so we'll just choose a forecast here and click apply. And um, this will this will give us forecasts based upon uh, Euromonitor's algorithms here, and looks like we're not forecasting these particular areas. Uh, uh, but in some categories, you can get actual forecasts uh, for uh, for that sort of thing. 
Now, finally, um, there are reports in here that have to do with consumer electronics. And if you go up here under industries, you'll see we've been playing around automotive. Uh, there is a consumer electronics section within here. And what we can do is go uh, into the consumer electronics section. And I'm going to look for analysis. I'm going to look for country reports. And then I'm going to change my geography to, to India here to see what's available. And we will do uh, go. And you see there is a report for in-car entertainment, but also information for all other kinds of consumer electronics in India and that sort of thing. So if we click here, it's going to take us to this category briefing, uh, a few pages of information updated in February of 2014. It will give you headlines, trends, you know, competitive landscape prospects, category data, and things like that. Uh, one thing I would encourage you also to do is look for under more related items here. There's information such as the business environment in India, consumer lifestyles, uh, income expenditure, then transportation, technology, things like that. So a great place to find additional information on doing business in the country as well as um, demographic information, things like that on, on the country as well. Hopefully this video helped you. Should you need more help, look for the contact link on the business blog. We'd be glad to help you any way I can. Take care and have a great day.